the, we have one more battle. The ox called. This is it, guys. One more fucking battle, and uh, I'm I'm gonna battle. What? Yeah, I'm fucking battling what? right now. Yeah. Who are you battling? I'm battling th this guy. Me and him, uh, we've been friends for a very long time. I'm with the guy that told you to do comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking kill him. <laughs> fucking stink. <laughs> Not in a bad way. Are you really you battling? I am really battling. I am. Yes. I'm battling. This is the, the final, the, fi the main event, as they say. You want us to turn the electricity off so you feel like you're at home? <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking Rich Voss with all the funny fucking lines. <laughs> Thank and you, Jeff and Thank Bonnie you, and Zero Moscow over here. <laughs> <laughs> Your final Tom poster, the reason I chose... Okay, Zach, what were you going to say, buddy? Tom, Tom got it. Uh, Your final roster, look, me and him have been friends for a very long time. He's written two books, and uh, I'm, I'm literally the reason this guy... I, I, I created a, a fucking business. I was running a show like 10 years ago, and I incorporated it as a business in order to get this guy in the country. Like literally, the reason he's in this country. I'm gonna tell you right now. But the reason. Wait, why are you in this country? <laughs> Puerto Rico is a commonwealth. So I incorporated a business to get him in the country, and this motherfucker wrote two books and thanked everybody in the business but me. He fucking. Because he knows you can't read. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think that's fucking low. It is very low. So that's why we're battling each other. This is it. So hopefully, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. This is going to settle the score right now. Ladies and gentlemen, clap it up as loud as you can for the one and only Aaron Byrne. Let me go Salazar's out. <laughs> let me, let me, I'm going to help him out because he's a fucking retard. They don't father? know me. It's my father because my dad was stabbed in there. <laughs> <laughs> they think it's fucking Elvis with an axe in his head, you moron. <laughs> he wasn't fucking chopped in the head with a knife. He was chopped in the hair. <laughs> you have a microphone, Aaron. Uh, you gotta start working on Thank you, arms. mijo. <laughs> My mijo. Oh, Jesus. You're battling Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> Thank you, Ricardo, and your esposa, and the you. <laughs> and Lucy's rider hat. Aaron, uh, you're the one who's taken it in the ass before, so you can call it in the air. Yes. Chance. <laughs> Chance. <laughs> Do you want to see ancient heads? Tails. Tails. Tails, I haven't seen money for years. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, I'm gonna defer Aaron. Where's Big J now to save you? <laughs> Luis Gomez. <laughs> my son, my mio. Sorry, Luis Ye Gomez. <laughs> The A stands for use won't represent him. <laughs> Louis did the best thing 
everything he could for his career, he had a child. When the industry heard he was a Puerto Rican with only one child, they thought Louis must be 17 years old. And they gave him new faces. However, Louis recently separated from his girlfriend, leaving her to take care of the child. This is known as traditional Puerto Rican culture. so he still gets food stamps or as his son calls them the real ass diet <laughs> Aaron Berg is 43 years old and has been doing comedy for almost 20 years yeah. The only numbers sadder than that are the tattoos across his grandparents' forearms. He <laughs> <laughs> was the Yolocaust. <laughs> Louis calls himself the Puerto Rican rattlesnake. Much like a rattlesnake, they both have dry, scaly skin, their mouths contain venomous breath, and they leave their young to fend for themselves. <laughs> That's a small baby, Jeremiah. Oh, Too soon. <laughs> that was actually my baby. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, Aaron Berg uh, quit drinking about two years ago. Clap it up for Aaron right now, guys. Clap it up for Aaron. Sober for two years. Uh, I'm so proud of him. Aaron, the only steps that you cannot complete are the steps to get downstairs at the comedy cellar. It's difficult. It's not easy. I need a, I need a youch. I need one person to youch. is infamous. That is the opposite of famous, kind of. No esta famoso. Uh, he's infamous for showing everyone pics of his dick. Oh wait, those are pics of his son. We would prefer pics of your dick because at least Obamacare would be able to fix the damage you did to that. <laughs> Aaron in the street, they think, wow, that guy's in good shape. When people see Aaron on stage, they think, wow, that guy's in good shape. <laughs> Aaron, your comedy is so disjointed and all over the place that it's no wonder that they sent your people to a place for concentration. <laughs> <laughs> actually provides a great role model for his son, Dave Smith. <laughs> be dressed as a dead dad, but you are a deadbeat dad. <laughs> That's one of the only reasons you're on Anthony Cumia's network. After all the racist accusations, he needed to do some black affirmative action. You may not be black, but you have minimal TV credits, a single baby mama, and you open for a comic from Philly. On paper, you're black. <laughs> In a couple of days, Aaron is performing at a suicide prevention fundraiser. Aaron, if I had to watch you do comedy one more time, I would light myself on fire like a Chinese protester. You won't find Aaron's album on the Billboard charts, but they did find a copy of it in Robin Williams' bedroom. <laughs> My mijo. <laughs> this accent is difficult after four jokes. <laughs> Louis is so stupid. How stupid is he? He's so stupid, his middle school education forgot to teach him that Puerto Rico was part of this country and he didn't need to have an anchor baby to stay here. <laughs> the J stands for just should have spent $30 on Plan B. <laughs> Metro PCS bill is due. It really is. Louis, let him have it. It's your father. Come on, Louis. 
much stretch. What the fuck? Aaron moved here, uh, moved to New York City right in the height of the alternative comedy boom. And to fit in, he got skinny jeans and a beard. Her name is Christine. She's sitting right in the back. Hi, Christine. Oh, I love her. She's not Jewish. <laughs> Richie Valens. Selena Salvador Dali, a list of dead, famous, talented Latinos. One day, my son, you will die, and that list will remain as it was before you die. <laughs> the J stands for Jay Okerson is the only reason you work. <laughs> that man's a fan. This is the last show. Uh, Aaron's career is a lot like Hitler's. He gets on stage and screams in front of crowds of terrified Europeans. The only difference is Hitler actually sold copies of his book. That was it. That was it. Give it up, give it up for both of you. That was a fun one. Uh, I had never seen anybody turn a roast into a one-man show. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, what do we think here? I really enjoyed the originality, Aaron. I don't know. I did not expect you to come out. You're funnier this way than you are when you do it on your own. <laughs> I really thoroughly enjoyed every second of that. Thanks, Lewis, you're a good sport for letting him do this. Yeah, you know, that was a... Uh, Great job hosting tonight, Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 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 You know, when he says great job hosting, you know what that means. You, you got, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Listen, you Back had... Back to hosting. <laughs> this time. I did. But, I did. Uh, I did. thanks for coming. I didn't get a fucking womp 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 womp. Did you do any of those? I don't know. I just, he, he prepared. You know what? This, he must think that there's industry here. Yeah. Because no one goes. This is what Canadians do. They go over and above. Look at that. Yeah. I'm telling you, that had to be two extra shots of steroids for this one. <laughs> yeah. Good, good job, both of you. Really. So who won? Who won? Who won? I started saying how did how was Rotterdam after World War II? Level. Really? That was the fucking joke you were gonna end the show with? No. 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 Uh, how do you look like you came here with our order from Seamless yet you have absolutely no delivery? <laughs> exactly. I had a great time. I gotta go, uh, I, Aaron. I gotta go yout for you at the comedy cell. Thank you. I really appreciate judging with Rich Bonnie and the guy who wrote Game of Thrones. Yeah! Yeah! Big hand for Jeff Ross. Yeah! I call that one a draw. It's a tie. Guys, clap it up for Aaron Brown. Yeah! Clap it up for everybody who's showing around with the Rose Masters. We're going to start handing out your bills right now, guys. Do you